Hi guys, we're fun from Overclocking TV. We're here at the uh, ASUS Open Overclocking Cup 2013, and we are with the third team. Uh, <laughs> guys, how do you feel? You changed from being two side by side with Team Front, then to the third place. How do you feel about that? Yeah, we were checking out some scores that were posted uh, after the competition was finished, and we were expecting that we will drop a little. Because uh, in uh, 3D test uh, we did not do our best, we have a lot of issues and uh, we are fighting till the almost end of competition and like maybe 30 minutes before the end of competition we start benching 3D. We, 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 we were fighting like 4 hours with motherboard, CPU, memory, one GPU, second GPU, we change and the assemble set up more than 10 times and uh, we are very happy that we managed to do any result because uh, we have very decent uh, graphic cards and uh, if the case was normal and uh, if we shouldn't have any issues our card will be like top three in every 3d test because uh, it can run higher frequency almost i think high as the other guys that are winning the stage mm -hmm. in 3d but we have problems, a lot of problems, you know, and uh, I can say that we are very tired and uh, almost happy to finish in top three. Because when we came to this competition, uh, it was uh, much heavier than last year, uh, more very good competitives. And uh, our plan was to finish in top five and we managed to finish the plan. Well, that, that's, that's a good achievement, at least. Um, what make you give uh, when the most point was your Super Pi 32M run, the, the first the first stage? Um, did you focus only on that and you say, okay, just screw the CPU D and max frequency, just go for a Super Pi 32M? Uh, it was a strategy made by us because uh, when you saw an agenda file, uh, Super Pi 32M had a bigger amount of points uh, than CPU Z. And uh, as my teammate uh, Dusan is very good at uh, Super Pi tweaking. He has very good uh, tweaking and uh, achieving good efficiency skills. So, uh, and I am also not that bad. <laughs> and I can, uh, I like to always to focus on memories, uh, f uh, secondary, tertiary timings. I uh, know a lot of about memory, so it was uh, the key to go with Super Pi. So you are like good tweaking and good memory skills so basically that's why you managed to get that good score in, in uh, Super Pi. Super Pi 32M is uh, my favorite benchmark and because uh, I like it because everything matters. Operating system, memory, um, controller, uh, anchor uh, frequency, simply everything. Each timing uh, can give you a big boost. It's everything, everything matters. Yes. Um, what do you have to say to the other guy that was like competing close to you guys in the ranking? Like you put out the scores in Super Pi, and then it was like, oh, okay, so just just focus on the 3D after that. Do you have something to say to them? Like, you know, I don't know, like good luck, see you next year or <laughs> maybe next time. <laughs> no, no, no. It was only one stage. We were aware that we need to push a 3D uh, almost good as. Uh, 32M if we want to be in top 5 and uh, the problem is uh, I don't know maybe a lot of bad luck lot of things happen bad because results we got uh, on, on, on uh, uh, back at home when we are protesting hardware with not so good CPU are much better than we, we made it here and uh, the point is we only need to repeat those scores here but uh, we didn't manage to do that uh, lot of issues uh, it's uh, it's live competition and uh, you need a little bit of luck and uh, it's it's uh, 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 if you are watching uh, first stage we uh, we won first stage at at, uh, at the last run b after the competition minute. is finished and we managed to improve our score for two seconds because we were also fighting with the board and CPU uh, it just won't boot, that is the problem. So we lose a lot of time in rebooting, rebooting, rebooting. But after after all this, we, we managed to get a very, very good score. Uh, if we had a little time more, we should improve it even more because we have we have 
space. We didn't uh, tight memory uh, as much as we can because we were running out of time. So it was a, I say, lucky run, you know. <laughs> Just in, we in put the, everything in it. In the last last seconds also. Um, yes. la last question, what do you think about the ranking system? The, the point system with two benchmarks, you can choose which one weight more for you and which one you want to focus on. Did you like that kind of uh, ranking system? Yes, I think it's very good because uh, like uh, in this competition, it allowed us uh, to uh, make a strategy. For instance, if uh, we had uh, bad CPUs, we could concentrate on uh, Super Pi 32M, which uh, was uh, a low clock challenge. Uh, and uh, simply focus on uh, freedom marks uh, like uh, Fire Strike or uh, 11, which uh, aren't uh, so uh, dependent from uh, CPU frequency, especially in single uh, GPU. Uh, but uh, for instance, uh, freedom mark 03 loves uh, high uh, clocked CPU, so it was an uh, obvious choice for guys who had good GPU and very, very good CPU. So uh, with this system of points, which is new for uh, such events, Uh, I think that uh, it's, uh, it uh, gave us the opportunity to uh, simply prepare the, the best uh, possible uh, strategy uh, for, uh, for the competition. Okay. Well, Team Europe, congratulations. Thank you very much. And hope to see you guys again for another event quite soon. Okay. Enjoy. See you. Bye. Thanks. Bye.